It's your boy Joselito con la pito and sofrito here to teach y'all today how I prep my canvases to get all those smooth transitionings throughout my paint sessions. Know what I mean, cause on a daily I get like a million people, more like five people, but it don't matter. I get people asking me how do I do this. So here we go. First thing I like to do is wet my canvas up, spray it down with some water. That way, uh, when I add my gesso over it, it spreads more and evenly. And I, I waste less gesso doing that too. Know what I mean? Things smarter, not harder. All right. So once I do that, I spread my gesso all around evenly. I know canvases say they come pre-primed, but I don't believe that shit. I don't believe that. And I ain't no lazy artist, so I'm going to prime my own motherfucker. All right. Let's get back to the point. So here I go using a blow dry because I am not a patient little shit. What I like to do is move fast. Get from one thing and go to the next. After I do that, I like to tone my canvas using... Nothing too dark, but nothing also too light. I don't like working over white uh, paint because it's it takes more time building depth and contrast when you just working over white paint. But doing this, you will get your canvas smoother. Uh, you can also work on a wood canvas that's smooth too. And the faces at the end of it will come out smoother and you will have to work less harder trying to build that transition in between variations of paint and all that. Now that you understand the secret to life and the universe and the cure to humanity and all that, go on, little grasshopper. Go on and teach the rest of, of humanity because I did not copy this from every master before me. This comes strictly from not me. <laughs> <laughs> 